in delightfully in here. And Cork have been in some trouble here. That's now Cahalan wrestling, and the referee is awarded a penalty. John Kearns shaping up to a great goal by Morris Fitzgerald. Is he weak for Paddy Hayes? He gets married on Saturday next to Valerie Cunningham, who is the sister of Jer Cunningham, the Cork hurling goalkeeper. But that's kicked inside, and it's bounced over the bar. Out there for Stephen O'Brien. He sold a couple over there. It's Billy O'Shea coming forward. A menacing raid here by Kerry. Ambrose O'Donovan coming into the equation, 40 metres out, outside towards John Cronin. Cronin, who can hit it with the left, does so and opens up a three-point gap once again. That's Cronin's first point of the match. Comes out towards Ambrose O'Donovan. Loose play picked up by Danny Cullity. On towards Teddy McCarthy. Shea Fahey. Bursting forward across towards John O'Driscoll. Out first time by Gleason. Not as far as Niall Cahalan. That's the point by Cahalan. That's Sean Burke performing manfully at right half back. Jack O'Shea now. A number of options available to him holding up the ball. Parlade was moving on his right. Jack doesn't need the support. He kicks it truly over the bar. to open space towards Billy O'Shea who's been marked by Mick Stoughton for the second half Lenny coming purposefully forward again knocking one forward to Parley crisply hit with the left boot and that's a delightful score by Parley and it's Liam Flaherty coming out from corner back held up there momentarily by Joe Cabin and Paul McGrath forcing the issue now trying to carry the fight forward here for Cork trying to impose their will on the Kerry team who've been leading all the way this is Tony Davis way up in an advanced position breaks down towards Teddy McCarthy 13 metres out and it's gone high, it's gone over, and there was a goal chance there for Teddy McCarthy. And it looked really good in Porky Cree. That's Eamon Breen kicking from 40 metres out. That's a terrific score. 111 to 9 points. Kerry finishing strongly now. There are 11 minutes to go. Morris Fitzgerald with the second point from play. His tally, a goal and seven. This is Morris Fitzgerald for a Kerry side trying to tighten the screw. Holds it up quite deliberately. Strikes one from way out and he's put it over. Back to Tony Davis. Four minutes to go. Cork needing a couple of goals. This is Barry Coffey. That's a foul and a penalty, or is it? It's a penalty, yes. Had to be. So Peter O'Leary for the second time in the match facing a penalty. The last was in the ninth minute of the second half. This is Shea Fahey this time. And they've missed the second one. An interesting statistic from this match is that Cork have had just two wides in the second half. Would you believe it? You'll have to. They were both from penalties. An amazing statistic. This is Billy O'Shea and a Kerry goal. A second Kerry goal of the match, and that will have killed off the tie, absolutely.